Hey, good day, folks. Welcome to another episode of Andrew's Life. Uh, hope you all in and you got your favorite beverage or snacks to eat. We're going to go on a short little drive here through Castleton, North Dakota, which is located in Cass County in the southeastern section of the state of North Dakota. 30 minutes east. Well, really, it's eh, it's kind of southeast. I guess it's more east than anything. But anyways, it's located 30 minutes. 30 minutes east of Fargo. Half hour east of Fargo. population here is 2,479 people and the town has grown by 6.4 percent as of the 2020 census. This town was founded in 1876. The town was named in honor of George Washington Cass, the president of Northern Pacific Railways who established a station here in 1876 for homesteaders. Castleton is home of four former North Dakota governors, Andrew H. Burke, who served from 1891 to 1893, Jack D. I'm not gonna even try to pronounce his full last name. He served from 2010 to 2016. George A. Uh, Center. He served from 1985 to 1992. William uh, Langer, uh, who was the 17th and the 21st governor, who served during the 1930s, 40s, and 50s. And when and after you guys get done watching this video, if you still are interested in moving here, or maybe you may have thought about visiting here and moving here, possibly even before you came across my video, the median rent prices are going to go from $570 to $1,400 a month, and the median home price typically is going to be around $280 grand a month. And now, right now, the cheapest house is currently for sale is priced at 285. And the crime here is low; it's very low, well below national average for both property and violent. I mean, basically, this is, basically this is a typical small town located in the Midwest. I mean, there's really nothing fancy or special about this town. I mean. Now, me personally, I find people here to be to be nice. People is, appear to be friendly here. It appears to be a nice, close-knit community here. I mean, as you guys can see, uh, there's a lot of people moving here. I mean, you got all these uh, later model homes built here. I don't know exactly how old these houses are, but just by the looks, I would say these houses weren't here, but for maybe, I would say a lot of these houses are less than 10 years of age. So yeah, if you're looking to live close to the Fargo, Moorhead, North Dakota area, but you don't wanna necessarily be in the city, I mean, if you got the money, you can always come out here. I mean, you know, basically, you're not far from the city. At the same time, you get to enjoy the small town feel. Now, some people will call this a suburb, but rather you call it a suburb or a small town, it's a small town. I mean, as far as, as, far as basic amenities are concerned, uh, there's not really a whole lot of amenities here. I mean, if I can remember clearly, I believe they do have a grocery store. 
But again, if you're looking for more variety of grocery stores and restaurants and all that good stuff, you'll have to drive a little further east into Fargo. I mean, west into Fargo. And basically, this uh, town is located off of Interstate uh, 94. And that's all, that's all I gotta say. I don't really got much to say about this place. I mean, like I said, people here appear to be nice. And it's just a nice small community to reside in if you don't wanna live in the metro. All right, folks, uh, feel free to add your little comments or your little two cents below if you desire to and get remember to su subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so yet and if you want to help me out all you gotta do is give videos like this a thumbs up and on that note everyone have a blessed one and i'll see you on the next one oh i forgot to add one more thing now, some of you, when you come across videos like this, uh, you might want to move here. You might be interested in living here, but uh, some of you have asked me in the comment section, well, what kind of work is available in areas like this? Well, in an area like this, uh, you're going to have, as far as it goes for work, at least for most of you, uh, your best bet is to go to Fargo. I mean, what I'm saying is if you choose to move here, you know, many people that, that live here, they most likely take that half hour drive west in the Moorhead and far into the Moorhead, Fargo, North Dakota area. And if you want to know more about the economy in, in the Fargo-Moorhead metro area, uh, I just made a video of Fargo uh, just a few minutes ago. So feel, so feel free to go watch my Fargo video. All right, folks. Now, I'll see you later.